Okay, guys, now I'm going to show you a couple sets of postcards. Um, these ones are by Joanna Basford. The first one is The Enchanted Forest. There's 20 postcards in this, in The Enchanted Forest. Um, it's glue bound with easy tear out. Fairly easy tear out. And then she picks some of her favorite images. Um, from her books to put on these postcards. They're nice and thick. This is um, 906 on Amazon right now, the Enchanted Forest ones. I've got the Secret Garden ones somewhere. I just don't know where they're at. If you guys really want to see them, I can look for them. The compass, the maze. I've seen this, the picture of the maze, not the postcard pic, but the picture itself done so beautifully the other day. In another group, um, looked like she painted cherry blossoms in it. The squirrel, <clears throat> the famous little sailboat, and then your meandering little path here. The owl, they're very small, so to color these um, should be fairly quick, but the details you're going to need your fine liners, I think, for sure. The elk, her little mandala with the horses or unicorns, I think it is. I don't, I can't see it very right. Unicorns. And then she had her little bunny triangular thing there. The dragonfly. The other side of that two-page spread that started with this, I think. Isn't it? The other side? I think it is. I'm not really positive. I actually have not colored much in this book. Just the outside a little bit, I think, so far. The hot air balloon. This is the treehouse village. Um, then another one of the little crest things with the bunny. And then the Fairy Enchanted Castle at the end. Um, these are published by Lawrence King. I, I like this book, okay? I'm not sad that I have it. Now I'm going to show you the Lost Ocean book. This disappointed me a bit. It comes in a little fold-out thing. I'm not sure if I showed this to you guys or not. And the squid. And there's 36 postcards in this one. Um, these are brighter white like Lost Ocean is. Same card, nice thickness, but the details on this baby is going to be a little bit tough. Some of them are actually so small that I can't picture doing them. Well, see, I'm looking at these first ones and they're not really so bad. Anyways, there's 36. Here's the seahorse crest. The ship, it's not so bad so far, but here, the details get really tiny on some of these. There's that famous page that I will never do. The sharks. Okay, maybe it wasn't as bad as I thought it was. The octopus. That's a cute little bit. The shells. This here, like the details on this, I can't. Boy, I just can't see myself doing that. So if you guys get a blank postcard from me with... You get to... Look at this, how small. I mean, seriously. That'd be some rough coloring for anybody, let alone me. I guess it's not as horrible as I thought it was. Here's the little Atlantis village. The Atlantis mansion but yeah like this one the details on this are so tiny I can't imagine doing it same with this one so yeah I guess it's more towards the back I thought wow who's gonna do this so yeah maybe I'll send these out blank and let you guys do them that's a thought right this one's so tiny, I can't imagine doing it. Little fishies don't look horrible. 
I haven't done this pick yet. My friend Kathleen did this beautifully. I love this pick that she did. And then the mermaid crest. And then here's the back. I've got the seahorse here if you want to color it. And there. Anyhow, I just thought I'd share with you the postcards. You can get the Lost Ocean ones are eight thirty-eight right now. I think I paid eight forty. And these are nine oh six right now on Amazon. If anybody's interested in these. Thanks, guys.